Place the weapon on fire. Weapon is on fire now. Charge the weapon. Charging the weapon. With the old Mark 19, to find the target, you need to get right down to the sights. But I have to be careful to keep my head back, because this beast kicks like a mule. The Mark 19 has a rapid rate of fire of 400 rounds a minute. That's a lot of firepower. But there is a lot of recoil, and it weighs a ton. So carrying this bad boy around, that's got to be a pain. It's the XM307's turn, and it's so steady, it doesn't even need sandbags to keep it in position. I say there's such little recoil from the XM307 that you could actually fire it with a cup of water right on top. You know me, I always like to test that stuff out just to see for myself. So we're going to throw one round down range here, see what happens. That's pretty impressive. And that minimal recoil means the XM307 can be made a whole lot lighter, too. Good news for the guys who have to carry it. Using modern materials, they've cut its weight to a mere 50 pounds, including the tripod. That's about a third of its predecessor. In a typical urban situation, often the only way to take out a hidden sniper is to use heavy artillery like a rocket, a mortar, or even an airstrike. Trouble is, with that kind of power, chances are it will destroy more than just the sniper. It's likely to take out the entire building, and in a city, that can mean higher collateral damage. But the XM307 has come up with a solution. One of the brilliant features of the XM307 it's a smart rounds. It fires. It fires a new 25 millimeter air burst grenade. With the XM307's air burst run, you don't need to go through concrete. You can go over the top and blast everything away. We've set up a typical sniper scenario with two guys hiding behind a wall and firing through a window. Now what we want to do is fire a one round through the window and just take out the guys inside. Air burst in here, blow these guys up, take them out so they're no longer a threat to your guys. And the room and the building is completely intact. Design specialist Mike Cutter is running today's demo. Now, I won't be using a live round, but with this training ammo, I'll get to see the amazing effects of this air burst munition. Weapons off safe. Taking it off safe. Clear to fire. Using the XM307 couldn't be easier. It's basically aim, laze, and fire. The laser rangefinder allows you to find your target and calculates the distance. It then programs the air burst round to detonate at a certain distance from the target. I've lazed the building. I know exactly how far it is. Let's put one round right through the window. Sorry, guys. See you later. There it goes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> The 25 millimeter airburst round enters through the window and goes off at the precise program moment midair, taking out the snipers, but leaving the building intact. And just like that, they're gone. If these were live rounds, those mannequins would be full of holes. As you can clearly see, the round went right through the window, dead bang, and then went off and took out the guys. How is that possible? When you lay to the target, you set a distance in the microchip in the, in the round. So that knows the time of flight that it needs to go that far. As the round goes through the barrel of the gun, that microchip picks up on the barrel the actual speed of the muzzle velocity it's going, readjusts for any fine-tuned errors that they had in powder charge or projectile weight, and the round is guaranteed to go off one meter from where you programmed it. That's amazing. So it's all electronic? All electronic. I mean, when I saw it go right through that window and then just go right off. Yep. Again, no collateral damage. We want to take enemy cover out of the picture. If they're hiding behind a vehicle, if they're hiding behind a wall, if they're down in a fighting hole, 
we still want to be able to reach out and touch him. But the XM-307 isn't just restricted to firing grenades. It has another trick up its sleeve, the ability to convert into a 50 caliber machine gun, the XM-312. Now I've heard that in two minutes, they can transform the XM-307 into the XM-312. Is that so? Maybe in about 153. 153, is that what you think? Yeah. All right, now I expect you to get it done. Give it to us, man. Here you go. Now, each gun is operated by two men, and this crew of Sergeant Eric Duncan and designer Mike Cutter are convinced they can beat the two-minute deadline. The transformation involves changing just four parts, basically everything that touches the round, including the bolt and barrel. 130. Once converted, the XM-312 fires 50 caliber rounds with the power to punch through lightly armored vehicles. <laughs> that was fantastic. One minute, 42 seconds. You gotta leave room for operator error. <laughs> <laughs> fantastic job. So why do you want to get this down to being able to transform this weapon from a 25 millimeter to a 50 cal in less than two minutes? Mission changes in, in a heartbeat from going from either a crew serve capability to be able to dismount it. Uh, in Afghanistan, I would have loved to have had something that I could bring a 50 caliber into the ground fight to be able to have a support by fire position up in the mountains right where I needed it at a moment's notice. And because 50 caliber ammo is available anywhere in the world, you're never going to run out of firepower. Ready to put some rounds down range? Let's make it happen, man. We've set up a brick wall with snipers hiding behind it. This time, I want to punch right through it to get to the bad guys. Safety's off. Start messing up the wall. The 50 caliber rounds make light work of the brick wall. And anyone behind it. And it feels like it's got the power, but there's no recoil. Right. There. It's easy to focus. It's easy to fight. It's tough. It's light, and it fires with almost no recoil. It's a grenade launcher and a machine gun. Plus, with the smart programmable air burst round, you have more precision and less collateral damage than ever before. With the XM-307 and 312, we have one killer cruise serve weapon that's fast, flexible, and delivers a ton of firepower. Still to come, I get a taste of the future with Stryker. It's the world's fastest, smartest, and most...